Hey guys, so I'm here to do a video today over some of my updates for my page as well as my Etsy. So um, for starters, I just want to say a big thank you to all my subscribers. I have a lot of new subscribers and I am only like 40, 50 away from 2,000 subscribers, which is crazy to me, and um, I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, it means a lot to me um, for all your love and support. So I am actually planning my 2,000 subscriber giveaway, and I kind of wanted to get some feedback from you and see what you think would be some good prizes. Um, I am a stay-at-home mom and we are on a limited budget so I kind of don't have an unlimited budget for a giveaway but I am in the process of getting some things together um, so if you have any ideas of some things that you think would be neat whether it be washi tape stickers from the store or stickers from my store or another Etsy store let me know and leave it down below so I really appreciate that and um, I am also taking part of a giveaway on Instagram and um, it, I believe it ends on Monday, I'm not sure. So I will leave the link to my Instagram below, but it is part of a loop giveaway with a bunch of other Etsy shop um, owners. There's, I believe, nine of us and it's awesome prizes. So please go check that out. Um, if you go to my Instagram and find the original posting of it, you should be able to see all the information and details on how to enter. It's really simple. So that is, I think, maybe all my updates. Um, my new listings have been slower um, to my shop, and I'm trying to get better at it. I had the girl's birthday party was over the past weekend, and it was just so chaotic. So I have been consumed with party plans. And now that the party is over, I am going to get back into more designing and getting up some new listings. And I am going to show you in this video, I thought I would show you some of the new listings that got put up today because they didn't get put up last night. As a, If you're a mom, you have to know that sometimes things just don't go as planned. And I had planned to get these up uh, yesterday. And that didn't happen so um, they are now up it is now Saturday and they are listed up in my shop so I um, I guess I will go ahead and go into showing the new listings um, and yeah that's all I wanted to say so thank guys for watching and stay tuned if you want to see the new listings all right so I'm gonna go ahead and get started and showing you the new listings um, I believe this one got put up on Wednesday. Um, I'm not sure what day. I ended up getting this one put up before today, but since I haven't talked to you about it or shown anything, um, I thought I would go ahead and show you here. This is my gymnastics class. It kind of goes with, it matches the theme of the ballet class ones that I put up last week, I believe it was. So that is this you get a total of 30 stickers on a sheet so there's a bunch of different like uh banner flags these flags right here and then these are also stickers as well so 30 stickers in total on this sheet and then this is an old one but i didn't have them ever listed um there are 28 of these on here these are hand drawn silhouette inspired stickers um and uh, a few of my planner buddy friends have received these in swaps as well but um i have never listed these on my shop because i wasn't sure if anybody else would be interested but i decided to go ahead and put them up and um so they're just hand drawn by me and they are little silhouettes with little cutting mats so these are cute for Reminding if you have if you're a crafter and you have a machine days that you want to do some crafting or if you are a sticker Maker or own one of these machines. It's a cute way to mark when you are making stickers. So that's that one Now this one I it's not a complete sheet because I have actually used it for photos 
and I ended up selling one of these to a friend of mine. But these are my new date night stickers. And there's actually two different designs on the sheet. So we have these um, arrowed ones with hearts. And then we have the just the hearts with the swirl designs on it. And there is a total of 36 stickers on a sheet. And this was a custom request because somebody wanted date night stickers that did not have the photos on it like I have my Polaroid ones. So I made these and I decided to list them for everyone. So that is on my shop. Another item that was a custom order um, were these running stickers. Um, these are for um, to track your time and distance when you run, when you're training for like a marathon or a race. So there is 44 of these smaller daily tracking stickers, as well as two race day stickers that you can mark your timing um, on them. And there, like I said, there's 44 and two, and these are made smaller than like a normal, um, they're not a half box, they're smaller than a half box, but these were mainly made for um, like if your monthly spread, if you wanna mark it, but you can also put these on your weekly spreads as well, so. That is one thing. And one of the new designs, there's 20 stickers on this sheet. These I'm in love with. Um, I haven't really seen anything like this. I have seen scallop boxes before, but these are my, I'm calling them, um, I believe I called it ribbon stitched boxes because it reminded me of like a ribbon around the outside and stitching in the inside. So it has a variety of colors, purples, pinks, green, blue, yellow, and like a peachy orange. And like I said, there's 20 on a sheet. So I really like these and I probably be coming out with more color schemes on this as well. And then after I did my plan with me Rapunzel theme, I got a lot of questions if I was going to list the Rapunzel um, stickers and I decided to. <laughs> so I kind of, played around and adjusted it into two sheets so they would fit better um, for mailing purposes. But um, this sheet right here has more of the decorative as well as some little half boxes. And there's another one right here, half box. And then you have here on this sheet the day cover date cover um, stickers. I did took off the date so they could be used anytime and you can write in or use other stickers to fill in the actual date number. We have um, a total of seven checklists. They just couldn't all fit beside each other. You have a, I'm call, I called it my weekend banner, but there's no wording on it at all. So you could probably put it wherever you want, but it's just like a bunting. You have these half uh, full boxes as well as this full box and then you have um, seven I did seven um, MD, MDN blank headers so that's them right here as well as some extra decorative stickers so it is a two sheet set and it is now listed in my shop so if you have any questions about anything please leave them down below and I will see you guys soon. Bye!